Yo, what is up guys? I am back with another video. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to bypass jailbreak detection on iOS in 2020. Let's get right into it. So the example I'm going to be using for this video is going to be Super Mario Run. Um, the reason I'm using this game as an example is because it was easy to download. It was not a big game. So I just went ahead and downloaded it and I knew it had jailbreak detection. So if you click on it, this is what will happen if you're jailbroken. It'll crash right out of the game. So I'm going to show you guys how to fix that. It's not something that's hard to fix. It takes only about five minutes. So let's go ahead and get right into it. So guys, the first thing you want to do when you're in City is go ahead and head over to Sources here. Click Edit. And then Add. And type in this repo right here. This is the repo that you guys want. Go ahead and click Add Source. It'll go ahead and download all the sources for the file. Once it's done, just click return to Cydia, then go to the search bar and type into here, type in Liberty and click Liberty Light, not the beta, just click Liberty Light. Click modify and install. Click confirm and it'll go ahead and download. Once it's downloaded, click restart springboard so that it can load the file into effect. Once that's done, go ahead and open up your phone, go into settings, and if you go down, there should be Liberty right here. There's a setting called Liberty. Go ahead and click it. Make sure Enable Liberty is on and Block Jailbreak Detection. Whatever app you are trying to unblock the, or I mean, block the jailbreak detection. So if you have like Snapchat or PUBG or something like that that has jailbreak detection, you can click those on, like Netflix, stuff like that. If, if uh, those have jailbreak detection on them, you just go ahead and Turn them on just like that, and they will be blocked from sensing that jailbreak that is there. So now I have Mario Run blocked, so we can go ahead and clear it out of here so that it updates. And let's go ahead and go into Mario Run. So you guys can see that it instantly loads into Super Mario Run after downloading that. The jailbreak detection has been successfully bypassed. And now I'm going to go ahead and get out of this app because I don't intend to play it. I just intended to show you guys how to bypass the jailbreak detection. So guys, that is how you block jailbreak detected apps on your phone. It is super easy. Um, all it takes is a few slides right here and it works perfectly. So thank you guys so much for watching my video. Please subscribe if this video helped you out because it would help me out a ton. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.